Have you ever wondered what really happens within you when you feel a strong connection with someone or something? It may seem like a common experience, but these sensations could be signs of a deep and mysterious magic that resides within you. Imagine that every feeling, every intuition, and every energy that flows through your body is not just a coincidence, but a manifestation of a powerful and ancient force inner magic is is not a fictitious or mystical concept reserved for stories and legends. It is a reality, a vital energy that is present in each of us waiting to be awakened and cultivated this energy, which many call prana chi, or simply life force, is the foundation of our being, connecting us to the universe and everything around us. But why is this magic so important? Well, this magic has the power to transform your life in ways you never imagined when you learn to access and direct this energy. You can experience a level of consciousness and well-being that transcends the ordinary. You can find a deeper purpose, a richer connection with the world. DNA sense of peace and happiness that comes from within. So, today, we will explore the secrets of inner magic and the energy that animates us. You will discover what inner magic really is and how it can change your life. We will dive into ancient traditions and practices that can help you awaken this powerful force within you after all. If you haven't accessed it yet, the true magic is waiting to be activated within you. Inner magic is the life force that permeates our existence, an innate energy that resides in all of us, waiting to be discovered and activated. It is not an illusion or a distant fantasy, but a universal truth that manifests subtly in our daily lives. We can say that inner magic is the ability to recognize and use this energy to transform our lives, expanding our consciousness and connecting more deeply with the universe. Since ancient times, different cultures and traditions have explored this mysterious force in ancient times. This energy was often called prana in the Hindu tradition in traditional Chinese medicine and K in Egyptian culture. These civilizations recognized the presence of this vital E, energy, and developed practices to cultivate and use it today. Modern science is beginning to understand this force through the lens of quantum physics and biology, recognizing that there is a vibrational energy that connects all things in the universe to illustrate the reality ID of this inner magic. I'm going to share a personal experience that changed my perception of the existence of this force during a moment of great personal anguish. I felt a deep need to reconnect with something greater than myself, and since many ancient traditions talk a lot about the e-power of meditation to access and activate our inner unpower, I decided to test it first. Sitting quietly with my eyes closed, I began to focus on my breathing, trying to calm my mind. As I concentrated, an unexpected sensation began to emerge. A lightness took over my body, and a feeling of warmth radiated from my chest. It was as if a flame was burning inside me, filling me with an indescribable peace. The worries that tormented me seemed to melt away, giving way to a clarity and serenity that I had never experienced before. This experience was not just a moan, entire relief, but the beginning of a journey of self-discovery that continues to this day. This feeling of warmth and lightness is the manifestation of inner magic, the vital energy that we all possess when we allow ourselves to access this. We open ourselves to a deep and lasting transformation. The connection I felt at that moment was more than a response. It was the beginning of a spiritual awakening, a reminder that true magic is not something external, but a flame that burns within each of us. Uh, and every time I dive deeper in to this journey of self-discovery, I begin to understand the true essence of our existence and the transformative power that resides within us. Of course, the experience I had was unique and personal. Each person has a different experience, especially in their spiritual awakening. When we explore the depths of inner magic, we are naturally led to the ancestral roots of this wisdom, where ancient civilizations already recognized and honored this sacred energy. These ancient traditions offer us a wealth of knowledge and practices, revealing how to access and cultivate to this vital force the emerald tablets attributed to Hermes. Trism Magistus are one of the pillars of this ancient wisdom.
These enigmatic texts, full of symbolism, speak of universal concepts about the nature of the cosmos and our intrinsic connection with it. The emerald tablets invite us to transcend the illusions of the material world and seek the truth that lies beyond appearances. They teach us that true magic and power come from within, from the recognition and activation of our inner flame. Hermes Tris Magistus, a figure many believe to be an enlightened being who transcended human limitations, conveys wisdom that goes beyond common knowledge. He describes the existence of a primordial energy that permeates everything referred to as the hidden light or the inner flame. He said that by harmonizing with this energy, we can access profound wisdom and transformative power. The famous phrase, as above, so below, encapsulates the idea that the microcosm, the individual, reflects the macrocosm, the universe, and that the key to unraveling external mysteries lies within us. One of the most profound teachings of the Emerald. Tablets is the search for knowledge in the heart of the flame. Hermes instructs us to seek wisdom and power in the heart of our own inner flame. He declares, you will seek the knowledge of power in the heart of the flame. You will be one with the heart of the flame. You will then seek within your own hidden flame. This passage suggests that the true source of power and wisdom is not in external places, but within our own being, in the center of our vital energy. It is an ancient knowledge that teaches us to turn inward, explore the depths of our soul, and find the light that shines eternally within this light or inner. Flame is the divine spark that connect, connects us to the whole, the source of all creation, and when we connect with this flame, we access an infinite source of wisdom and power capable of transforming our lives and guiding us towards our highest purpose, Tantra. A spiritual tradition originating from India also offers us a path to understanding and working with inner energy, unlike many spiritual practices that seek to transcend the body. Tantra teaches the sacredness of material existence and the bow. Die as a vehicle of divine energy. Kundalini energy, represented as a sleeping serpent at the base of the spine, is central to tantric practice. When awakened through practices such as meditation mantras and specific postures, Kundalini ascends through the chakras, activating energy centers throughout the body and leading to heightened states of consciousness and spiritual realization. Tantra reminds us that true magic is not in escaping the world, but in transforming our earthly experience into something sacred with divine energy. The Yoga Sutras of Pat Anjali, a fundamental text of yoga philosophy, offer a Systematic approach to cultivating inner magic Pangali describes yoga as the control of the fluctuations of the mind, allowing the light of consciousness to shine without distortion practices such as pranayama, breath control, dhyana, meditation, and samadhi deep absorption are tools to purify the body and mind facilitating the direct experience of our essential being. The concept of prana is central in yoga. By learning to regulate and direct, prana practitioners can achieve a state of balance and harmony, eye awakening the magic that exists within each of us, with all. This we realize that these ancient traditions share a common vision. The energy we seek outside of ourselves is already present within us, waiting to be awakened through dedicated practice and deep understanding. We can access this force and transform it into a powerful tool for our growth and well-being. It's as if you are an alchemist of your own life, transmuting the subtle energies that flow within you. Each practice, each ritual, each meditation is a step on this journey of discovery and transform. Asian, and when you integrate these teachings into your life, you not only honor the wisdom of your ancestors, but also become a co-creator of a reality where magic is a natural part of your being. As I mentioned before, this vital energy is discussed in various spirit, spiritual, and mystical traditions known as prana in the Hindu tradition, qi in traditional Chinese medicine, and often referred to simply as life force. This energy is absolutely essential for our physical and emotional well-being. 
Prana derived from the Sanskrit word for life or breath, is seen as the universal energy that flows through all. Things in the practice of yoga and other spiritual disciplines, prana is understood as the current that sustains life and health. It circulates through nadis energy channels and chakras energy centers, regulating all the biological and psychological functions of our body without a harmonious flow of prana. The physical body and mind fall out of balance, manifesting as illnesses and emotional disturbances in yoga. The practice of pranayama, which are breathing exercises, is used to increase and control P. Rana breathing in this practice is not just a biological function, but a powerful means of influencing vital energy. Similarly, Qi is the foundation of traditional Chinese medicine, considered the vital force that permeates the universe. Qi flows through meridians, energy channels that connect all the organs and systems of the body. The practice of Tai Chi and acupuncture are traditional methods of manipulating Qi to promote health and balance when Qi flows freely and without obstruction. The body and mind find themselves in a state of harmonious balance, preventing diseases and promoting general well-being. In Tai, with its slow and deliberate movements combined with conscious breathing, helps to unblock the meridians and allows the energy flow freely. Acupuncture, on the other hand, is a technique that uses fine needles inserted into specific points on the body to release energy blockages and restore the harmonious flow of qi. Through these ancient practices and traditions, we realize that the connection between vital energy and our physical and emotional well-being is deep and complex. It's as if the bee, Bodhi, were like a system system of rivers and channels. When these channels are clear and the water flows freely, the whole ecosystem thrives. Likewise, when vital energy flows, unimpeded, our biological systems function optimally and our physical and emotional health flourishes. Feelings of joy, peace and vitality are signs that our prana or chi is in harmony. On the other hand, blockages or stagnation of this energy can lead to feelings of anxiety, depression, or even physical illness as we learn to feel cultivate and direct this energy. We gain a new perspective. Ive on our health and well-being, we become more attuned to our body and mind, able to perceive imbalances before they manifest as serious problems and more capable of living in harmony with the flow of life. Our inner flame is a source of power that can completely transform our perception and experience of life. Awakening This flame is not just a journey of self-discovery, but also a deep connection with the essence of our being. This flame is the source of our intuition, creativity, and capacity to love. When we access this flame, we align ourselves with our true nature experiencing a state of fullness and fulfillment that transcends worldly worries to access this powerful source of energy. Meditation is one of the most effective tools. Meditation allows us to silence the mind and turn our attention within creating a space where the inner flame can be felt and nurtured. A simple and effective practice is heart meditation. You can sit comfortably, close your eyes, and focus on the center of your chest where the heart chakra is located. Imagine a small flame burning there, feeling its warm warmth and lie. Shti spreading throughout your body with each breath. Visualize this flame growing stronger and brighter, radiating peace and energy throughout your being. The heart, in many spiritual traditions, is seen as the center of our energy and wisdom. It is not just a physical organ, but the spiritual core where our deepest essence resides. The heart is the seat of love, compassion, and intuition. By connecting with the heart, we open ourselves to our true nature and to the inner flame that resides within it. For this reason, practices that focus on the heart, such as meditation or the practice of gratitude, can be especially effective in awakening and cultivating this flame. Another powerful technique is the golden light meditation. You can sit comfortably and close your eyes. Imagine a bright golden light above your head. With each breath, Visualize this light slowly descending and filling your entire body, starting from the top of your head and moving down to your feet. Feel this light purifying and energizing every cell, dissolving blockages and restoring the natural flow of energy. 
This practice not only awakens the inna, our flame, but also harmonizes and balances your energy field. Introspection is another powerful method to awaken the inner flame. Taking time daily to reflect on our thoughts, feelings, and actions helps us better understand ourselves and our connection to vital energy questions like what brings me true joy or how can I live more authentically can serve as guides on this introspective journey. When we explore these questions, we begin to uncover what obscures our inner flame, allowing its light to shine more brightly. There are other practice that are also essente. Al in this process, such as conscious breathing and energy work. Breathing is a direct link to our vital energy techniques, like deep rhythmic breathing can help balance and intensify the flow of prana fueling the inner flame. One of the most effective pranayama exercises is alternate nose breathing. Sit comfortably with your spine erect, use your right thumb to close your right nostril, and inhale deeply through your left nostril. At the top of the inhalation, Close your left nostril with your ring finger and exhale through your right nostril. Inhale through the rig, shti nostril. Close it with your thumb and exhale through. Left nostril, continue this pattern for a few minutes, keeping your breathing slow and deep. This exercise balances the energy channels and promotes a harmonious flow of prana. Another effective prana D is fire breathing. Sit up straight and put your hands on your knees. Inhale deeply through your nose and then make short, quick exhalations, pulling your abdomen in with each exhalation. Maintain a steady rhythm. Concentrating on the movement of the abdomen, this exercise increases the circulation of prana, cleanses the energy channels and energizes the body and mind energy works such as visual visualization, and creating energy balls also helps to strengthen this connection. You can imagine yourself holding a ball of light, between your hands, feeling its energy pulsate and vibrate as you breathe. Try to see this light grow and expand, filling your body with vitality and clarity. This inner awakening is a continuous process of self-knowledge and dedicated practice, but it can be truly transformative. The, the more you cultivate this inner flame, the more. You begin to notice subtle but powerful changes in your life. You can feel a greater sense of peace joy and purpose. Your relationships deepen, and your actions reflect more authenticity and compassion. Each technique, each conscious breath, and each visualization brings you closer to the essence of who you really are, allowing your inner flame to shine more brightly. So I would like you to remember that true transformation does not happen overnight. It requires practice, patience, and an unwavering desire to dive into the depths of your being. The magic we seek is not an illusionary trick, but a real force that exists within each of us, waiting for the right moment to emerge and illuminate our lives. Inner magic is both a journey of self-discovery and a daily practice of presence and intention. Every breath, every moment of silence, every meditation and visualization are steps towards a life that is fuller and more aligned with our divine essence. So I hope that this journey awakens in you. A new perspective, a recognition of the immensity of your potential, and a deep connection with the life force that animate, as all creation. And may you find peace, wisdom, and courage to continue exploring the depths of your being, allowing your inner flame to shine more and more brightly. Thank you for embarking on this journey with me. If this video resonated with you, I invite you to like and subscribe to our channel, share this video with others so they can benefit from this message, and don't forget to leave a comment below, sharing your thoughts, reflections, and experiences. Thanks again for watching and for joining me. Take care and see you soon.